Amanda, you've got a sweet, gentle little guy here. I definitely do. This is Rex, and I affectionately refer to him at the shelter as my shadow, because whenever he is around me, he follows me right to my heels. Even when we're walking on a leash, he likes to stay right by my side. Uh, he is a three-year-old Chowini, uh, Chihuahua Dotson mix, um, and he came to us as an owner surrender. And Rex uh, lived with another dog in his other house, but uh, his world got turned kind of turned upside down when a baby came along. Um, Rex didn't really like the baby. He says, I'm the baby. So, um, you know, they did what was right and had to surrender him so we could find him a more appropriate home, maybe where he is the only child. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because he wasn't, he wasn't too thrilled about the baby. But, you know, he's a little shy at first when, um, you first, when he first meets strangers and, and like going to the vet, but he warms up really quickly. Um, he was definitely shy when he first came here, and now, as you can tell, I was less than a week ago, and he's basically my best friend. <laughs> Doesn't he have the best smile? He definitely does. And, you know, he's full-grown, awesome size. He's about 10 pounds, 15 pounds, um, healthy. You know, uh, they were keeping him outside when the baby was born, um, so he had a few fleas on him, but we've got him on some good flea prevention, and he's got no more fleas he's neutered now he's fully vaccinated he heartworm free um, just looking for a home maybe without kids or bigger kids he's adjusted very well hasn't he Amanda to... uh, yeah absolutely you know a shelter environment can be very scary to little ones at first um, and uh, they have quick adjustments though our dog walk is going on outside, so we're just giving him a little walk in and, here. And he walks, I mean, so close to you. It's, you know, he definitely wants to be there with you and watch over you. I actually took him um, to the vet in my own car the other day. I mean, he just rode along in the car so well. Right in the front seat. There you can get a good look at his uh, Chawini body. Yeah. <laughs> it's just great. And those ears, too. He's got the radar ears of a Chihuahua. Mm -hmm. So he's alert and intelligent, no question. And this great short coat, you know, he doesn't shed a whole lot, so that's wonderful too. Uh -huh. House train? Uh, I do believe so, yeah. Um, he's very eager to go out on his walks, and before the baby came, he was an indoor dog. Um, and they did crate train him as well when they were gone for long periods of time. So um, since he was an owner surrender, there's that wonderful questionnaire that they fill out um, that you'll get when you adopt that talks about all things that he knows and what he dislikes and what he likes. Um, so it's a good way to kind of get to know your pet in the beginning. I know one thing he likes, he likes being in your lap. Oh my gosh, as soon as I sat down, it was like, that's my spot. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, he's uh, so adorable. We'd have him sit for you, but he just got neutered yesterday, so we're going to give him a break. Sit? Can you sit for me? Boy, he's doing especially well for having gone through that. You a good boy? What a great guy. Are you a good boy? Oh, he he's likes to hug you. He's yeah, a he's hugger. a hugger. Yes, Look at it. He is. He's hugging you. Look at that. He is a good boy. Yeah. Yeah. I love you too. Aww. You sweetie. Boy, that's pure love. And he's only known me for a few days, so you know, once you, you know, when you first meet him, he might be standoffish, but once he gets bonded with you, oh my gosh, he's your best friend. Wow. Yeah. Please come see him. This is Rex at the Nassau Humane Society in Fernandina Beach, Florida, right across the street from the city airport. Just, just a sweetheart love, and he needs you. So please come see him. Please come see Rex.